So the next stage would be to go inside your uh, system by clicking on the Windows button and then clicking on Settings and then clicking on Update and Security and then clicking on Recovery and then Advanced Startup and click Restart Now. Remember this is this step is more complicated than other steps and it's not for an average user you need to be quite advanced so follow this with a uh, big caution so you click on restart PC would be restarting and then you select troubleshoot Then you go to advanced options. Then you go to command prompt. Then you will get here where it says command prompt and choose an account. So choose your account. Then you go to enter the passport. then you go to your system command type in disk part and then click enter so Microsoft disk part version 10 whatever and then we enter from X drive into disk part in here type in list disk enter so this is all the disks that we have and you should have already recorded the disk that you want to do format type in list volume and enter so you got all these volumes I mean this is what I got so this is really the important bit uh, I already took the picture of the volume that I wanted to delete as you can see I don't know how visible it is but uh, I have selected my uh, volume I took a picture and following that picture you can see the name of the volume and you can see the capacity which is 97 GB so mine is media and um, and it is 97 GB so it's important to note down the name which is the label and the size this part is really important you have to now type in select the volume that you would like to format select for in my case volume 2 and then click enter so it says now volume 2 is selected so after selecting volume whatever volume that you got you want to format you have to be careful again I uh, can't emphasize enough uh, then type in format fs is equal to ntfs quick one final check and then click enter So it says 100% uh, completed. This part successfully formatted the volume. So now you can just close this and then click on continue. Your computer will restart. As you can see now the E drive is formatted after restarting the PC.